Today's another day that uh, I can relay another interesting fact about John Schley's relationship with Ben Hogan. And what is really interesting is how they got together, interacted, and then Ben Hogan flat out said to John, he said, I will teach you everything you need to know about the long game, everything you need to go from tee to green. I know you're a good putter. You're one of the better putters on tour right now. This was back in the 60s, uh, late 60s, or, and then early 70s. And um, John, John was so interested. He just said, just show me what I need to do to make my swing like yours. And Ben Hogan said to him, he said, John, he said, I am a cripple. He said, my golf swing is my golf swing because I am a cripple. He said, the minute you start copying my swing, you're out of here. I don't want anything to do with you if you're going to try and copy my swing. What I'm here to teach you is I'm here to teach you how to swing a golf club the best you can with the body that you have and don't go following me. He said, I slide way too much in my swing. He said, I, it took me years upon years to get that slide timed to the point where I could, in fact, hit golf balls the way I wanted to. But he said, there is no need for that. There's no need for it. So what I'm about to teach you is going to be fundamentals and principles that you can relate to all your students, other people, if you want to teach, because he didn't, didn't know at that time. He was more interested in winning U.S. Opens and Masters and things like that and learning from Ben Hogan than he was in teaching. But as time went on, he knew that he could uh, relay this information. And um, it's interesting that Mr. Hogan was that adamant about his swing being that of a cripple. So for all those students that I'm going to be teaching right now, don't compare yourself to Hogan's swing. Compare yourself to the fundamental and the principle that is involved in each and every part of your backswing, your downswing, your follow through, and make it the best that you can with the body that you have. And I look forward to teaching and passing on to many, many people what has been passed on to me from John Schley, which in turn was passed on from Ben Hogan. John spent four and a half years with Ben, ben Hogan. I spent a little over seven years with John Schley. And I have so much that I can give and offer in the insight of the golf swing that Ben Hogan himself wanted to pass on. So let's get started.